Take out the safety pin. Okay, cadet, you take out this EPUB. Take out the safety pin. Over here, over here. Yeah. Yeah, so this is the EPUB. Okay. Take out full equipment outside. Yeah, take out, take out, take out. Yes. Bring the cover. Okay, let's go to the bridge. Yeah, put on top of that, yes. Put it there. Okay. You see there is one light also provided over here no? and you have on button ready and test so these three things are there okay this is the EPUB okay what is the full form of EPUB emergency position indicating radio beacon it is a radio beacon which will give you the position but not to the ships, not to the vessel, not to any boat. Okay. The main idea of this equipment is to provide information that there is some distress on board any ship to the coast station. The main idea is this signal will not go to the vessel, to the fishing boat or anywhere. This signal only go to the coast station. Okay. So what is the thing? When there is a distress situation, when you have abandoned your ship and your vessel is going to sink inside the water. So that time, it, they, uh, for activation of this one, you have two methods. One is manual, you see here, yeah. these three things are given, no? On, ready and test. So, for testing, you will bring here and leave it. Now you see. Okay. So one plus. So that means this is working. Testing is complete. So for testing, you no need to remove this safety yeah. pin. Huh? This safety pin, this safety pin is very important. It should be always here. So for testing, you no need to remove, just turn it toward the test. You will see one blinking light, one flash. That means it is working, tested. But when there is actual situation, what you have to do? You have to remove the safety pin and then turn it to on side. Okay, turn it to on side. So what will happen once you turn it on? So the thing is, there are various satellites around the earth always rotating. The name of the satellite is Cospas Sarsat. Okay, these satellites are geostationary satellite. So they will receive the signal from EPUB. What is the signal frequency? 406 megahertz. 406 megahertz frequency. So this signal will go from here to the satellite and from satellite, it will transmit it back to the LES. It will be relayed to LES, land earth station, coast station. Okay, this coast station, they will know that this EPUB belongs to whom? Each and every EPUB is belonging to some ship, like a code. Same like you have identity card, right? Your national identity card, same card. If I put that identity card number in your country, I can know this is for you. Same like this EPUB also registered only for ship specific. Okay, so this is ship specific. Same like you buy your car, so what happened? You have to go register on your name. So if this registration number coming, they know this car belongs to you, correct? Same like that here also, they have a specific code and it is registered for particular ship. So once this signal goes from here to satellite, and satellite transmit the signal to the host station. Host station know that from which ship it is coming. Correct. So once they know the information that this ship is in distress, what they will do? They will relay again the message to the nearby ships, MRCC, RCC and Coast Guards. So whatever the rescue coordination centers are there, they will start following you using this signal. 
so they will give that this is the location please all the vessels mrcc rcc and coast guard please proceed whoever nearby the area to rescue them okay to help them so these guys will get the information and they will start going towards the distress vessel and they will come once they are nearby you then you have to use the sart okay sart comes into play after that so once they come close nearby 12 miles 40 miles aeroplane then only you can know then you have to activate your sart then from there sart will take over this is just a homing signal to the land earth station okay and other thing about this is the battery backup for ipa is 48 hours it will work for 48 hours i told you before it has two method of activation one is by switching on from gear manual another one is automatic you see here there are two yeah things are provided one here and other here so these two ones go in the water it will like a electrode so two circuit will complete and it will automatically on so once it once it is on manually then you have to turn from here once you don't have time you have abandoned the ship the when ship will sink in the water it will go in the water then it will activate automatically because it is connected with hru i shown you on the top so it will no need to break or remove from the glass from the cabinet the cabinet will automatically cut off and it will come and start floating on the water okay then it will activate automatically again we try to test so let's see is it working ah it is working so that is the one okay so any doubt anything you want to ask me you can ask very frankly yes if we mistakenly activate the sensor uh huh okay so the question is by mistake if you have activated it actually how you are going to do what is your action remember this epa is a distress equipment so whenever by mistake you activate this what you have to do you have to send a cancellation message to the nearest post station that from this ship it was activated by mistake please cancel my epa signal transmitted on this time the first job after activation by mistake is switch it off again first thing switch it off again and then bring below some metal side below some roof so that the transmission transmission should st stop immediately so once you bring inside the bridge switch off it will stop transmitting but it is not the thing that you have done fully after that you have to prepare a cancellation message then you have to send to nearest a uh, post station that is the procedure that procedure you can find in the gmdss volume 5 also okay so i will show you very soon Okay. Okay. Put the pin. 